here's a Bootsy Quickie, hints, tips, and fun information. I've been having a lot of fun uh, with slow stitching, and uh, if you've seen the previous video, you'll know that I've made a flat doll, Mildred. Mildred had eyes that were slow stitched on from a piece of uh, fabric, and they were unusual eyes. So in my effort to make another doll, I decided to explore uh, a facial um, template from online, and I didn't like that at all. So I created my own. Let me give you a view. I want to make a face about this big. This is my point. There is pointer. This is my pointer. Um, and I've been struggling with the idea of what kind of uh, eyes to put on uh, my next doll. Well, I decided to choose French knots. Here's where we are headed. I left the focus, automatic focus on because uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of this and it's going to go in and out of focus. So here's a concept. Now these are French knots, but they're made with uh, unusual French knot threads, not even threads, fibers. So here's been, this was my experiment. You can see this. Um, if you look on the back, close your eyes if you're uh, easily disturbed by a horror. <laughs> Here's my selection of items that I've tried. Here's some tool or netting. This is some netting that comes like this in large, large quantities. I have a bunch of that. This is a piece of very fine rayon. Uh, here's some more netting. And this is some very, very thin ribbon. I tried um, cutting zigzaggy pieces of fabric and I tried them and it's not let me see if you can see. Come on, focus, focus, focus. I think it's easier to put it on the other camera, which I will in a minute. And that didn't that didn't work um, as well as I'd like it. But let me show you a close up of how some of these knots came out. So let's take a look at these. They're really neat. I kind of had a lot of fun. This is um, a light a light uh, purple lilac organdy kind of tool. No, it's not organdy, it's tool. That comes on, on those rolls. This is a tool that comes on the roll. You see them in Joann's all the time. Ooh, sorry. This is a off-white, almost a pink tool. This is that f big uh, batch of netting that I showed you, but it has sequins built into it. This is a piece of light rayon. Here it is with one wrap. Here it is with three wraps around the needle. And this again is the ribbon, the orange ribbon. I am so thrilled with the way these turned out um, that I thought I would make this short video. And it's very, very simple. You have to choose your weapon carefully. You know. This is uh, going to make some of the old timers giggle. Oops. This, you can see, is a little bit aged. <laughs> this is a standard sharp needle. Look, oops, look at the difference in sizes. And I had to do that, and I'll show you why in a minute, um, because of the thickness of the item you're choosing. So I haven't done this yet. Let me try this ribbon. It's 
a little bit thinner than the orange ribbon that I tried. And I want to give a special shout out to Lizzie Brewer of uh, Scrappin' Lizzie Unicorns. because She got me started on the idea of exploring more um, French knots when she was doing a uh, slow stitch demonstration. I'll show you what I do with that. This comes, this comes from these rolls. You see them all the time in Joanne's. So let me get a piece of the purple. I never know how, how much to cut. So I just cut. Choose your weapon. Uh, I'm going to pick, let me pick this one. I don't know why. Uh, tie a knot at the end. And uh, a lot of times you'll wrap one time. Well, it all depends on what size knot you want. This is, uh, I'm sorry about the uh, focusing, but there's no way to get around it. This is two wraps, this is three wraps. Two wraps, three wraps. Very, very pretty. So like any French knot, make sure I don't go into the back. You know what, let me take my face and do it on the side here. Come through from the back. I'm going to make three wraps. One, two, three. The secret here is to not pull it too tight. <laughs> and make sure the ribbon stays threaded in the eye of the needle. Now see the, oops, let me make sure that stays down there. We have to go through all those wraps and it's thicker than thread. So it can be a little ornery. This one seems to be working fine. Look at that. So this is a very pretty knot. Again, if I can get it focused. Three wraps. And to me, they're going to make some really great uh, eyes on my next doll. And I can give her purple or I can give her orange. Anyway, just a quickie to show you what I've been up to. Uh, thank you for st spending time with me. Um, be safe, stay healthy, be smart, and uh, see you soon in another video. Bye for now.